This is our mini steam plant. And so what I'm going to show you is how we set everything up and then we'll show you how it's supposed to work. So the first thing we do is we take distilled water, get it relatively warm so that we won't use a lot of fuel in order to make it um, heat up inside the boiler. And we have to fill it up to about two-thirds full. There's a little window on the other side over here. Then the next thing we're going to do is put the top back on. Make sure that our connections are relatively tight. And then we're going to put the fuel and these are from the same company that um, makes this type of unit. This unit is made by a company called Jensen and we get the fuel from a company in Germany. You can purchase these online. Most of the units that they have actually have a, an electrical outlet in order to heat up the fuel or the, the water. In this case, we like to try to use the fuel so that you get an idea of what it's like inside of a real boiler. So what we're going to do is to heat this boiler till the steam is starting to flow, have the steam come across here, and have the, the unit start to turn. So this would be what would be the turbine. And then when it's turning, this is the magnet, and these are the wires that are around inside the magnet. As it turns, it will generate electricity. Hopefully we'll see this light bulb turn on, but if not, we're going to use this voltmeter to try to see the voltage that might be coming on when this is going. It has to be going at a relatively high speed to get the voltage high enough to turn on the light bulb, and that doesn't always happen. Now we wait. 